How much does it cost to open a strip club business? It is one thing to dream of owning a strip club. However, the first thing you need to do is bring your dream of owning a strip club to reality is to know the cost implication. In this video, I'm going to reveal the cost breakdown of starting a strip club. But first, let us analyze the exact factors that will greatly determine whether your cost of operating a strip club goes up or down. Major factors that determine the cost of opening a strip club. 1. The type of strip club. Strip clubs vary and the difference is based on what the owner of the club wants. It could be just a strip club or a business operating as a strip club and bar, nightclub or even a fully functional hotel with a strip club. Strip clubs typically adopt a nightclub or bar style and can also adopt a theater or cabaret style. Upscale full-service strip clubs often provide a wide array of guest services and on-site facilities. Commonly found amenities may include on-site food and beverage, room service and restaurants, meeting and conference services and facilities, fitness center and business center. This classification is based upon the quality of facilities and amenities offered by the strip club. 2. Your choice of location. In business, location is a key part of what determines the success of the business. For example, renting or leasing a strip club facility in a location that is off the city center or off a major road will be less expensive when compared to renting or leasing a strip club facility in a highbrow area. A highbrow area in this case would mean a location along a major road with high vehicular and human traffic, a location in a metropolitan city with the right demographic composition of people, mostly upwardly mobile young adults. Most successful strip clubs are those that are located in highbrow areas where social life is at its peak and properties in these areas can be expensive. Your location should pass security and fire code before you open to the public. 3. The Required Licenses and Permits In the United States of America, you cannot open a strip club without first applying for the mandatory licenses and permits. You would need food and drinks handling license, building license, zonal permits, and kitchen permits amongst others. These licenses and permits cost money, and it will influence the overall cost of opening a strip club. Please note that there may be several inspections you must pass before you can be issued your licenses and permits and this will also cost you money. 4. The Type of Facility Most strip clubs are located in buildings that are converted bars, restaurants or warehouses or had industrial uses. The original layout of the building will affect the physical layout of a club. The more money that has been invested in a facility, the more it resembles a dedicated club, regardless of the floor plan. As an interactive theater, there are features every strip club will have. They include performers, strippers, a floor area where the customers will congregate, and some form of staging for strip tease performance. Higher-end gentlemen's clubs have features that cost millions of dollars to install and maintain. You have the options of renting, leasing, or designing and constructing your own strip club facility from the scratch. As regards renting and leasing a facility, you might just have to spend extra to modify the facility to fit into the picture of what you have in mind. But there is a limit to how far you can go, and it will be dependent on what the landlord of the facility wants. Let us assume that you want to construct your strip club from the scratch. It means that you will buy the land or a property, bring up your design, and of course construct and equip the facility to fit into what you have in mind. With that, you will agree that you are going to spend way more when compared to people that rent or lease a facility. This indeed will greatly influence the overall cost of opening your strip club. 5. Menu and Additional Service Offerings The fact that there are different types of strip clubs means that these strip clubs serve different menus and offer different services. A theater or cabaret-style strip club offers a very limited number of on-site amenities and often only offers no accommodation and with little to no services. These facilities normally only cater to a specific demographic of travelers, such as the budget-minded traveler seeking a no-frills fun. Nightclub or bar-style strip clubs offer limited complimentary food and beverage and alcoholic drinks at all. 6. The number of halls and rooms available in the club No doubt the budget for opening a 3-hall and 20-room strip club facility will be far above the budget for opening a single-hall and 10-room strip club facility. 
Aside from the cost of constructing these halls and rooms, it will also cost you more to furnish and equip the halls and rooms. And the more the number of rooms, the more you are expected to spend. 7. The Cost of Hiring and Paying a Business Consultant and Attorney As expected, if you want to get your business started on the right foundation, it will be a wise decision to hire the services of a competent business consultant and perhaps an attorney. A business consultant will help with drafting a workable business plan document for the strip club, a marketing plan and strategy, a comprehensive SWOT analysis for the business, and other advisory services that will help with opening the business. So also, an attorney will help you with registering the business, drafting contract documents, and offering you all the legal expertise that will help you start the business on the right foundation. Of course, you will agree that these services will cost you money and it will indeed influence the overall cost of operating a strip club in the United States of America. 8. The Cost for Branding, Promotion, and Marketing the Strip Club Strip clubs are profit-oriented businesses like restaurants and other retail establishments. Performers and staff are the primary customer service representatives in the club environment. Strippers are the primary vehicle to entice customers to spend time and money in the establishment. That is why it is important to spend money on branding, promotion, and marketing of the strip club. 9. The Cost for Furnishing and Equipping the Club Trust me, the cost of furnishing and equipping a strip club is huge. Aside from the basic facilities that are expected to be found in a strip club, an investor that wants to open a strip club may decide to spend more to make the place look unique. Before you can open a strip club, you should budget for chairs and dining tables, gas cookers, deep fryers, fridge, deep freezer, microwave oven, storage hardware, counter area equipment, flat screen TVs, sound system, DVD players, satellite dish and decoder, furniture, telephones, filing cabinets, store equipment, cash register, security, CCTV, ventilation, signage, serving utensils, and fancy lighting amongst others. All these will cost money. Now aside from the factors we just mentioned, you are expected to pay your employees, pay utility bills, and stock up with inventory. These are the key areas where you are expected to spend your startup capital on. 1. The total fee for registering the business in the United States of America, $750. 2. Legal expenses for obtaining licenses and permits as well as the accounting services, $3,300. 3. Marketing promotion expenses for the grand opening of the strip club, $3,580. 4. The total cost for hiring a business consultant, including writing a business plan, $2,500. 5. The total cost for the purchase of insurance, general liability, workers' compensation, and property casualty coverage at a total premium, initial, first premium, $2,400. 6. The cost for renting or leasing a space or warehouse that will be converted into the strip club and that can accommodate the number of customers that will come to watch live performance of strippers and to purchase drinks and food for at least 12 months. Reconstruction of the facility inclusive will cost $180,000. 7. Operational cost for the first three months. Salaries of employees, payments of bills at all, $40,000. 8. The cost for startup inventory, stocking with a wide range of liquors, wines, beers, tobaccos, and small chops, $15,000. 9. The cost for the purchase of storage hardware, bins, rack, shelves, food case, $3,720. 10. The cost for counter area equipment, countertop, sink, ice machine, etc., $9,500. 11. The cost for serving area equipment, plates, ashtrays, glasses, flatware, $3,000. 12. The cost for store equipment, cash register, security, ventilation, signage, $4,750. 13. The cost of purchase and installation of CCTVs, $2,000. 14. Equipping the strip club, flat screen TVs, sound system, DVD players, pianos, satellite dish and decoder, furniture, tables, stools and sofas, telephones, filing cabinets will cost $40,000. 15. The cost of launching a website, $600. 16. The cost for throwing an opening party, $3,000. 17. Miscellaneous, $2,000. 
From the rough estimate, you would need a minimum of $318,900,000 to establish a medium scale but standard strip club business in any city in the United States of America. Please note that this amount is subject to an upwards or downwards change as the factors of production may vary with location. Also bear in mind that inflation and the exact time of your viewing this information may cause price changes, which we can't be held liable for. There you have it, a detailed analysis of what it would take to start a strip club. Do you own a strip club or you think there is anything I missed out? I would love to hear it in the comment section. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel right now. Just click on the subscribe button below this video.